Guess what day it is? Guess what day it is? Huh? Anybody? Julie, hey, guess what day it is? Oh, come on, I know you can hear me. Mike, 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 Mike. What day is it, Mike? <laughs> Leslie, guess what today is? It's hump day. All right, people, welcome back to your bonus hump day daily duel. So are you guys ready to get humped? Yes. I'm not, I'm not going to, I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to keep it like that. Yes. <laughs> anyway, we have Stanzi here. All right. Hello. Yep. So uh, for those of you who are from Simo's channel, you guys are probably like, all right, what's the, well, what's your channel about? Well, I mostly do duel videos, but I do other content as well that you'll see. But it just happened to be Wednesday, you actually get a bonus daily duel. So you get daily duels uh, Monday through Friday, but on Wednesday we decided you're going to get a bonus daily duels to add more tag partners. And Stanzi is, of course, one of them, but he is also the co-host of the league that you guys are pretty much coming to the channel to see. So, uh, yes, it's mm -hmm. going to be us two commentating on the duels. So get hyped. It's uh, starting this Saturday. Yep. All right. I, I, I guess I'm done shameless plugging, so I get... I, you're dueling and you're clearly using uh, the uh, Odd Eyes Magicians, which is a tier one yep. deck in the league, and yeah, I'm it's... and I'm using Infernoids, which is a tier two deck in the league. So uh, oh, damn. be prepared to see these two decks uh, duke it out. <laughs> so I uh, actually got a comment by someone, and oh, and thank you guys for all the subs. Oh my god, like you guys just tore it up. Like I gained like what a hundred subs in like one night, and and you know what the funny thing is, uh, my phone, I my phone. I made it so every single time uh, something like a wow a comment... that salt sorry just wow that salt <laughs> wow. skillless pendulum, pendulum fag. fag wow Ooh, you fag wow all right uh, pretty much every single time I get a comment or you guys hit the subscribe button my phone goes off I get an email I couldn't get to sleep <laughs> which is you know it's just totally fine you know I appreciate it because every single time you guys hit that sub button it was, my phone was going off. All night, all morning, and it was just, mm. <laughs> oh. But uh, someone commented, oh. and they were like, you know, Odd Eyes Magicians is a tier one deck. I mean, it's a powerful deck. You cannot, li is. you can't lie. It is a powerful freaking deck. It's got its own, and... like, sort of stop your shit every turn. Oh, Gradles. Oh, Grendel. Yeah, Gradles. I won't know. See? Stop your shit. No. Yeah. Nope, fuck he, you. He wants to go ahead and take I love how shit. you're calling me a pendulum fag. You're just trying to stand still all my fucking monsters. Like, thanks. <laughs> See? Skillless. Oh wow. my god, D don't use that. Don't use that, Steve. Alright, alright. Alright. Okay. Damn. Yes! We win. How to win? <laughs> Damn. Who Wow, that all that assault though for playing pendulums, like mm -hmm. damn. <laughs> See a skillless, skillless fucking con. Oh, go kill yourself. World doesn't need skillless bags like you, like nigga. You're playing fucking sixty card gray dolls with four in the extra deck. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, Lee, hey, I mean, all right, fair enough. I was being dirty with it with the bloody ancient leaf, but for fuck's sakes, if you're gonna run gray dolls, at least run forty cards in a full extra deck. I mean, come on. You don't know what you're stealing, so you need to be prepared for all situations. Yep, so. I didn't even get the duel. That sucks. Nope. <laughs> oh well. Well, go ahead and get another duel in. So, we'll be right back. Gosh. Alright, we're back. Gonna get another duel in. This hand is. Ooh, yeah. I opened up really well. I got it. Don't worry, and before I put two cards in the fucking pendulum scales, I got called a fag cunt again and fucking <laughs> Like damn. Oh, all right. Oh. What were you saying about pendulum scales? Oh, here we well, go. I, I'm saying that if we can stop them getting their pendulum scales, then we're good. That's what magic scepters need. Yeah, yeah, they definitely need their pendulum scales. They need their scale up at all times. If you can get rid of their scales, they are going to just patter out. Because they'll hit you, keep hitting you with back row, but eventually they're going to run out of the monsters to tribute for the back row, and then they're fucked. It's okay. all about the booty. <laughs> Alrighty, let's go. And do this. Good luck. I said, magic factors are just ugh. The power. Any pure pendulum paste deck, it's just the power. Like, like them being able to search for a back row, like oh my god. I know. And then usually, you know, they play the counter. You know, they play their traps and their spells, which would usually be a neg because they attribute the monster. But then they just go back to Hector and pendulum zone them back. So. If you could break their scales, the deck's still a little bit scary, just because, you know, they still have a, a lot of back row, but it's not too bad. 
not as bad as, not as, bad bad as it scale. could be. Yeah, they have their pendulum scales, then prepare your booty. Oh, yeah. Prepare the booty. And it opened up pretty well, too. I opened up fairly decent, too, but I'm probably just going to get fucked over by better, unless this gets me a roll decree. It did not. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, roll decree? No. Oh. Yeah, because that is one thing that my deceptors do not have is spell and trap destruction. Nope. So you, the, the great thing is you can go out and pendulum summon, but he's just going to place a counter trap card and... I'm not going to fall for that. <laughs> <laughs> and, get, and you're just going to get wrecked. Yeah, I'm not falling for that. <laughs> Instead, I'm going to just try and pop one of your cards, because very... Oh, Air Force! Air oh. Force, alright. That's an interesting one. Yep. You don't see that card too often. Just because it's not, not that good right now. It's, if Compulse is good, that card is good. Yeah. Mm-hmm, but I, if, if I have the choice between Compulse and that, I'd rather play Compulse, because it's faster. Yeah, it's faster. <laughs> Hell. Oh, yeah, you can Air Force them and send multiple stuff back, yeah, but I can just Compulse you, and therefore stop an Exiton, for yeah. example, you know? Just, yeah. oh, when you've got two fours, well, you're probably going to go into Exiton, just Compulse one back, get rid of it. Yep. So we're going to have some intellectual plays, hopefully have some intellectual commentary, so... I hope you guys are hyped for the league, and I hope you guys just don't come for the league, because I have a lot to offer on my channel. Uh, clearly, as you can see, I even do videos like this, so uh, you're probably wondering, you know, and yes, that number for Daily Duels is correct, 699.5, yeah. Uh, on Wednesdays, you get an additional Daily Duels, so you get one at 10 a.m. Pacific Time, and then one at 2 p.m. Pacific Time. Come so, on, Mr. Magiceptor guy, hit me hit with a... your counter trap, because I'm trying to activate my effect. Go on, yep. do it. <laughs> yep. So, uh, yep, you get episode 699.5 and 700. So, yes, there are 700 daily duels. So, <laughs> I'm not saying you have to watch them all. You guys can just start watching from here on. But, uh, yes, uh, Monday through Friday and then two on Wednesday for daily duels. I really wish this guy would batter on me. I know, he's just thinking for so long. Like, if you want to he's do, a, it, he's, you do he's it, He's having a good old conundrum over there. He's like... Do we have to Shia buff you? He's like, no, I'm like, I'm like... Hit me with the bat row, and he's just like stroking his beard, like, but why? <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Just play your counter trap. It's obvious you got it. Huh? Shall I buff it? <laughs> <laughs> just do it. <laughs> do it now. <laughs> Get to the chopper. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you be the terminator. I'm being Shia buff. Uh. I'm just going to let him know that I know which one he's got. <laughs> it's like, yeah. he'll, he'll be like, oh yeah, I don't know what I got. It's kind of trap. How did you know? Well, hopefully so, it's the counter trap. Not the regular the time has kind of filled up here, yeah. so you want to do something quick, Mr. Person, before you... <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, I'm not even sure if he's still here. I thought he died at his computer screen there. Holy okay. shit. Well, okay, I still fine. got my search, so... Yeah, but now you can go ahead and summon. Because now he doesn't have a Magister Spectre to, to freaking uh, tribute. Yeah, Watch him have true. Blackhorn. But I, but I can't. I played, uh... Thingy, didn't I? I played my... Uh... You fusion Conscription. Yeah. Can't spec... Yep. So you can't summon Odd Eyes. Uh, I guess I could search a Saber Dragon and summon that and just hit him for 28. Do whatever you want. I mean, it's not terrible. Being able to apply... Apply? 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 I'm, not, I'm not even Asian. That's right. Apply. <laughs> apply more pressure to our opponents. It's not terrible. No. Alright, we'll try it. Then watch him before he has Solemn. Okay, oh, that's, that's just the one less Solemn. That's another, yeah, that's another one. Yeah, that's, that's, that's just one less back row we have to worry about. That's fine. It opened up pretty well, so. I'll just set that as a bluff. If you want to go after that, although you should probably should go after my field spell, because I'm just going to keep searching and plussing off it. That's why I hate Pendulum. You're the one playing the fucking Pendulum deck. Aren't no, you? that's oh, the, no, other guy. the other guy. I was about to say. I was really about to yell at him, man, like, you're the one playing the fucking Pendulum deck. What the hell, dude? That's right, go for the field spell. Yep. Yeah, now you just gotta get another MST to get one of the scales. <laughs> <laughs> See? That field spell's good. I love it. Ah, uh, field spell's good. Power. Yeah, it just, it's just like, no. You know, field spells as of late have just been getting really good. Like, yeah. Extremely which, well, good. Yeah, which is good, considering usually they suck the butt. 
Ah. Uh, <laughs> you know what? At least you're on Ice Heavy Dragons level 7. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, but I think I'm going to go ahead and activate the reasoning. Alright. Yeah, I'm going to. Right. Well, like I said, if you just want to play it safe and just use my dragon, I'm not bothered. I'm not going to overextend. I'm going to I'm gonna hold it down. You know? What I noticed though when I when I tap with Infernal, it's better for me to just get set up and, and stay back and let you resources and then jump back into the duel. Yeah. Yeah. Oh damn. Oh damn. Oh fuck. Oh damn. Oh, oh damn. No. No. God no. Oh god no. Damn. Okay, I'm about to say I know I run so much. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Well, you thought dragon rulers were bad that they kept coming back. Um, yeah. So what does this card do? <laughs> destroy the monster by bouncing the guy. You can destroy one monster you can't control now. Yeah. It's not yeah. a great of an effect, but it's an effect. It's mainly just because it's a 28 beta and it's level 7. And it's an odd eyes. That's why I, I run can, it. I could go for Star Eater. <laughs> you could if you want. Do you run Star Eater? Yeah, I run it. Could go for that if you want. I mean, yeah, if you want, it's up to you. I'm not really bothered by, about the odd eyes, Saber Dragon being on the board or not. What do you think? Should I go for it? Yeah, you uh, have to probably go if, for it. If you want, if you want, if you want. Go for it, go for it. I mean, still can't summon any Infernoids, so. And go ahead and have this man hold my dick. Yeah, man, man, what? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's come shining on. Shining angel. Fucking... <laughs> ah, I wish you had an Armadies after Actually, the Saber Dragon would have got its effects and blown it up. I know. Yeah, <laughs> damn it! <laughs> I just... Oh no. I should have saw that coming as soon as I saw him trading that blue eyes. Whatever, yeah. it's, not, it's not even good to get that card anyway. To tell you the truth, what the I can't, hell do you have in the grave? I have everything in the grave, man. Everything. Everything. Except, except for a skull prisoner, which you've got set. Yeah, I drew it. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Only drew on one or two. One. Oh yeah, number generator. Yep. I drew. I drew skill prisoner. Yep. yep. Steamo people, you're going to uh, understand the uh, power of number generator. Yeah. For, for those of you who do not know what a number <laughs> generator is, uh, it's a pretty much a theory that I came up with and they have proven countless times that uh, for, for systems like Dev Pro, DN, Wanjo Pro, stuff like that, that they're not, it's not really randomized, but actually a number algorithm system that increases the odds of you getting cards at one so you see them more often. So, I mean, tell, tell me the truth, tell me the truth. You've opened up a hand or you dueled your opponent and you've just seen cards at one over and over and over and over. <laughs> okay, am I gonna... Okay. Snatch? So I guess he's gonna go ahead and search for his spell card to destroy the Star Eater. Which I, I could just chain Skill Prisoner and block it. And be like, nope, screw you. Oh, oh no, right. that switches was, monsters, yeah. That switches monsters. Well, I, I mean, should really learn this deck there. <laughs> you should. All I mean, these I've, monsters I've... look the same. <gasps> That's so racist. <laughs> <laughs> I actually love the design of the monsters, though, especially Fox. Fox looks really cute. And Fox is the biggest asshole of them all. I know, but he looks so <laughs> cute and adorable. I can't fucking stand it. He looks so fucking cute. I want to smother him with a pillow. He looks adorable. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> what? He is so adorable. I just want to just snap his neck off. <laughs> I just he looks so adorable, I just wanna I just wanna fucking pound him one dick style. Like, what? <laughs> wow. That's right, you heard it here first, folks, on Yubo uh, Mastery's channel. Stars eighty seven would like to pound someone long dick style. Uh <laughs> how about get the fuck off my monster? I really would like that, Star Eater, so go suck a dick. Oh, it only protects from monster effects. Oh, I forgot about that too. I think that's like hey, the I second like time everything. I've done that. Yeah. I never see that card, so I don't bloody ever think of it properly. Hold on. Hold on mm -hmm. to your scales, because I might go Deviati next turn. Oh, alright. Yeah, I can definitely go Deviati next turn. Mm -hmm. Alright. I know, I'm bad. I run this guy. But the only reason why I run this guy is just for more Infernites in the graveyard. 
because this guy is, I know, he's not good. That's, that's one that no one ever runs, so before you guys fucking crucify me in the comments, section, like, it's just more more inferno, it's because I'm mill oh. enough. I was like, who can get special summon the Locus or a whole bunch of them, like, everyone? Oh, right? I mean, you can go ahead and summon Inferno if you want to. <laughs> nah, alright, I'll just go and pop that. So, let's go pop a card. Oh, well, if you're gonna go ahead oh, and do that. Oh, get your Tempest, nice. I was say, if you're gonna go ahead and do that, then why should, then I'm not gonna Deviati, there's no point. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's not like, unless this freaking Magic Scepter guy and he's bad and he's running blue eyes. Oh, wait, it could summon it from the graveyard, can it? Yeah, yeah, it can. I... Oh, mm. shit. He's just gonna summon the one from his graveyard. Wow. He actually made a card that's not really good when tag deck's actually pretty decent Hang just on. because he has the blue eyes in his graveyard. Yeah, but this, yeah, but Anuchu can just wipe it. Yeah, yeah. If you wanna go ahead and drop Anuchu, go ahead. Alright, um, I'll drop Anuchu on him. Right, which one to banish? Uh, the small one. Yeah, yeah Hamadik, Dantra, um... and shit like that. What about Sijit? Sijit, or whatever. Anantra, Hamadik. Yeah. Those three. Alright, time to Dark Hole. Look, because I'm a pendulum. Look, because I'm a pendulum, it really doesn't matter. Yep. <laughs> so you got a pendulum shotgun? Nah. Oh, okay. I just go attack. If you want to waste it, I think you're pretty good to put it on one monster just so you can use your effect. Yeah. Besides, I mean, itself. if you want to use a back row just on this friggin' Anuchu, then go ahead. Yep. Yep, what? Let me yeah, guess, you're going to be another guy? Pendulums are broken. Right, what do you do? I think he, banish, he tributes to banish a card. Yeah, he transitions when I'm a spell trap is activated. Lights. No, 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 no. A neutral what? is when a spell trap is activated. You can tribute a monster to negate and to banish it. So it's asking you if you want to go ahead and negate the Mirror Force, which at this point really doesn't matter because you're going to get... Either you're gone either way, so... Alright, well, screw it. Yeah. So, Onuchu and Deviati are different than the other ones. That's what I'm saying. I if you, if you, you would have summoned the monster... Deviati was the one that uh, negated and stopped, and Onuchu no, no, no. was banished. Devi, Deviati summons and heavy storms, and then tributes to negate monster effects. Onuchu summons and dark holds, and then tributes to negate spells and traps. Oh, alright. So it's the other ones that negate to banish it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they don't I've like, I've like play, dabbled in Infernoids, but I haven't like played them much. So. Like I said, I hope he overextends, because I could literally just drop a new true slash Deviati again, so... Mm -hmm. If he overextends with a monster face-up, I can end the fucking duel right now. Like, literally, I can do all that damage to him. So, I hope he does. Oh. Uh, time to just drop another fucking Anuchu. <laughs> I guess. Wow, I can do so much, I just don't know what I want to do. Well, if... Hmm. If I were you, I'd just go a new chew, because you don't know what that face down monster is. Play it safe, just wipe it. Yeah. So, we'll just go ahead and summon a new chew again. And let's go ahead and banish the bad ones that I'd never use. Yeah. Hamadek is still expensive. I know. I think, I think it's the name. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Alright, yeah. sure. And guess what the number generator allowed me to top deck? Uh, I don't know what. Fair soul right. charge? Why would I play soul Wait. charge in this deck? I don't know. I don't thought so. I thought the number generator was like, what's the best what, limited card? Soul charge. Wait, that makes no sense. Burial. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Of course. Uh, should I just do him now? I'm thinking, I'm thinking I'm doing him. Cause we're gonna have that's gonna be a lot of damage. Yeah, let's do him. I don't want to mill anymore. I'm I'm I'm, I'm milled out right now. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm kind of worried I'm gonna deck out, especially in this tag duel. Mm. You ready for the big damage? Yeah. And then it'll jump three thousand. Well, now if he plays a monster face up, I can definitely have to go. Vegeta. Well, OTK. What does this guy say about its power level? <laughs> It's over 9,000! <laughs> I wish I could put that video clip in, yeah. but I can. They'll hit me with a third party. And while I don't care about the revenue of my videos, I don't mind it. <laughs> you know, I'm not like, you know, <laughs> okay, that is OP. <laughs> okay, that is OP. Yeah, it is. Okay, yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, you, have you finally got your scale set? That's fine. I assume you would have, because why wouldn't you not? Yeah, if you can stop his scale, stop it. 
Hell no to your scale. Watch your mother not. Mm -hmm. I don't know which one to tribute. Uh, I'd tribute the new tutor since you can just come yeah. back. Yeah, I can only use the effect once per turn anyway, so. Yeah, and then you might as well keep an 11,000 beta on the bloody board. Oh, you got another crow? Or a yeah. five? You got another Any five? Other? Raccoon not, or crow? That's game. Yeah. <laughs> Agiceptors, the they're, only as as the they're only as good as their scale. They're only as good as their scale. And that's what people aren't getting. Alright, uh, I think that's about it for me. Yeah. I'm going to have to go. So, what time is it we at? We're at 20 minutes, so literally wrap this duel up and then that's it. Yeah. Alright then, so that's it pretty much. Yeah, I'm just waiting for them to either quit or lose. Uh, they've already quit. Oh, they did? Yeah. Oh, the guy put the face, then he set a card, and then he quit. Oh, they're pro froze for me then. Oh, that was fun. Yep. <laughs> well, thank I you, like, Debro. Yeah, it froze for me. Hey! Alright, so yeah, there you go. So, uh, go ahead and introduce you to Stanz87. So, if you want to go ahead and check out his channel, link in the description. He will be my co commentator for the league, which will be this Saturday. And uh, get hyped for it. So, thank you guys for hitting that subscribe button. Thank you for coming over to CMOS channel. As I'm still trying to network and, you know, hopefully get other big YouTubers to allow me to uh, uh, spread the news. Because I think this will be an awesome, awesome idea. I know a lot of you people think it's a great idea. Tons of support. Uh, so, hopefully season one goes well and we can come back for season two, which will be so much better. Even so bigger. Better. Even bigger. You know. Uh, Plans I want to do for season two include more teams, so I, I definitely want up it to sixteen teams, four divisions, and uh, you know, creating like a form where you guys can join the teams and actually allowing for a deck editing. So each week, you know, you who you're going to be facing, so you guys can go ahead and edit your deck and your side deck accordingly. So uh, yeah. Anyway, um, thanks for watching. Thanks for uh, hitting that subscribe button, checking out my channel. So this video is usually supposed to go up at ten. It's now like ten o four. So probably that's it. Late. But uh, I, I should get my videos. You guys will get contact from me at 10 a.m., 12 p.m., and 2 p.m. Pacific time um, every single day, uh, Monday through Friday, and then the league will be on Saturday and Sunday. So you guys get content from me pretty much every single day. So I look forward to it. So uh, thanks for watching, and uh, yeah. All right. <laughs> See you guys in the additional daily duels that you'll be getting, episode 700 at uh, 2 p.m. Pacific time. All right, people. Thanks for watching.